Charm French here and welcome back to my channel and today as you can tell by this, the title we have our latest in beauty pics. Now I'm not sure when you guys are going to see these because uh, I have a, a couple of videos that I need to go up before so you may actually see it in the first week of November but this is my October pics. October? Yeah this is my October pics um, but yeah so it may be that you might see it a little bit late just just a little bit so you might get two latest in beauties in november but yes before i start and ramble on about latest in beauty if you are new here please subscribe to the channel and see what's to come and if you do enjoy the video please give it a big thumbs up it's what gets me noticed here on youtube let's get into latest in beauty so if you've never heard of latest in beauty before it is a beauty subscription box where you are in control uh, each month you get to go onto their beauty counter and you pick six items that you would like and it can range from anywhere from hair care to skincare to makeup you name it it will probably be in that list um, and I love it I know I say it every month you guys know it is my favorite subscription box it's the only one that I have kept doing and kept uh, kept more so because I really really enjoy it and if I didn't unbox it on here for you, with you guys I would still get it I would still get it I really do love the box it is $12.95 plus $3.95 postage each month um, and obviously you get I think most of the things are full size you can get dupes sometimes into picking smaller ones it's always best if you check if you click on the item that you want it will tell you the size there when you click it um so yeah each month you get to go on and choose six items um the things uh, new things roll in each week um you can go on to their blog and it will list everything that is going to be uh put onto the site for that month it does it in a random order you don't know which which new things are going to drop on which week it's just a case of checking it every monday because i think it's every monday they update it um so yeah if you see something that you want to wait for sometimes it's best to wait and just wait for that item unless you see other things that are and they come up it's entirely up to you um but always i will say make sure you make your picks before the end of the month because they will pick them for you and they aren't always the best picks so it's best to just pick your items before the end of the month so let's get into the box so this month it's come again i don't know if this is bigger i've had a smaller box and then a bigger box but this is this is this is i don't know i don't know what size this is but yeah this is how the box has come i've obviously opened it already and inside there's a little sneak peek and what the box looks like on the inside i forget what the theme is this month i forget um but there's always a hall of fame product and i can't remember whether i chose the hall of fame this time um but we're gonna get into my items. So the first thing I can see is a leaflet that says known, and it's because I chose a specific item, which I may as well just grab now. I really wanted to try these. These are your daily dose of vitamins that actually taste good. So these are known nutrition, and it's an immune booster, um, which I thought was like, I thought I definitely need after having coronavirus. Um, I thought why not have some like immune boosting gummies. Now the colder weather's coming in, I thought it was the perfect thing to get there's 60 gummies it's a vegan food supplement um it says normal function to the immune system antioxidant defense normal energy uh, yielding me metabolism redu reduction of tiredness and fatigue which i am always tired i don't know if that's like a covid thing uh, but lately i've just been always tired so it has uh, essential support with vitamin c zinc selenium and b6 and they are raspberry flavored and i think i'm going to start taking these tomorrow um i won't take one now because it's a bit late at night um but yeah essential multi-action formulation provided a daily boost to the immune system defenses so that's what it looks like and like i said it's 60 so i think that the well, a month's worth of gummies is it 60 60 60 is more than a month right I have no idea. I'm not going to do the math because I'm not smart enough. But yes, there is 60 gummies in there and I'm definitely going to use them. There is also a little voucher in here and it says, known uh, one for you. Get one, one month free when you subscribe. Um, and then there's also one for your friend as well. So I can get... Um, if, if anybody if anybody wants a code just obviously drop me a message on instagram uh, but it, there is a code to get your your friend one month free as well so it's a little leaflet in there i like that it's cool right the one thing i can see which i did know that we were going to get and i'm super excited for it and it is a ellie Saab sample now i have girl of now it is my favorite perfume my husband bought me on our wedding day and so it's it's my wedding scent but this one is ellie Saab le perfume lumiere um so it's a new one and i have had a little snap 
little a little sniff and it smells quite nice so i'm gonna use that up and see how i feel maybe i found a new favorite i don't think i found a new favorite i still love girl of now it's just got happy memories for me but i love i love the elisar perfumes if you've never tried them you should totally get a sample if you've got the latest in beauty you'll get this sample for free in your box everybody's got it um, and it's really really nice so the next thing i chose oh i should have said <laughs> i've already showed you the first product but i will put the prices of each product up on the screen up there so you guys can see them so you know how much this box costs and sometimes these box costs like you get so much for your money like i think my last box was a hundred and something um obviously and i only paid 12 pounds 95 plus postage so um yeah i will pop each like price up there you've probably already seen the first one um so the next one is the majesty is it majesty majesty pure 24 karat gold eye cream i love an eye cream you guys know this um, and it, had, it has gold in it. It's brightening shadows and deep puffing. Um, I'm currently using an argan oil, I think, one that I got in a previous box. And it's like really big, so it's going to last me ages. But when you see a product come up that you love, you should just totally get it because you never know if it's going to stay in stock. Sometimes they do roll over into the following month or a couple of months later. But um, if it's a good one, you should totally just get it while you can. Uh, because you never know. So yeah, it's an eye cream. It looks like this. Obviously, you guys will have seen the price at the top. That's what it looks like. And what does it say? Effectively reduces puffiness and dark circles under the eyes. It just is how to use, apply on the skin, under the eye, and rub generally. So what was that? Then I chose this. This is, this is a Nabla Dreamy. Is it a lipstick? Liquid lipstick. And um, these were up like last month, I think. Or was it the month before? I don't know. But I saw them and I was just like, I really want to try it. I love the packaging. It's really, really cute. Um, I went for the shade My Rules. That's what it looks like. I love the packaging. Um, obviously, you'll have seen the price. So I don't know how much the price is. I can't smell anything. But my sense of smell is a little bit warped still from COVID. So, oh, that's a nice colour. That's a nice colour. So that is what the look liquid lipstick look like i like that shade that's really nice i will definitely use that this is it vegan it's cruelty free um what is oh 100 vegan so it's vegan and cruelty free obviously you guys are listening to the price but that's really cute i like the color right so the next item i chose is a makeup sanitizing spray um i thought i'd give this a try i don't think this is like a makeup cleaning thing it's just literally for uh helping remove bacteria from products cream products and more it says so it's literally just a, a sanitizer for any makeup that you have and i just thought i'd give it a go because sometimes i do do other people's makeup obviously i'm using my own stuff and i keep it as hygienic as i possibly can but i like the idea of sanitizing eyeshadows and things before i use them so i got that it says lab tested and approved um they're lightly scented with avocado so that's what it looks like obviously you guys will have seen the price up there that um if i do seem like i'm rushing edward's not very well he's not been very well he's had a bit of a cold and it's kind of developed into a bit of an ear uh, infection so i may have to film this super super quick and go downstairs um so yes okay next we have i think this is another bonus pro uh, product this is a Cetaphil moisturising lotion. A lot of people love this. I actually haven't tried it. I tend to give the little samples away to people. Um, but I'm going to give it a try when I've run out of moisturiser. But I have a lot of moisturisers to work through. But a lot of people say this is really, really good. And this is a 29ml sample. I'm assuming it's a sample. But if it's not, I'll pop the price up there. If I can find it. Oh, it says sample not for sale on the back of it. So yeah, a little Cetaphil one. And then we have this. Um, I think this was the Hall of Fame product. Um, and I was just like, I'm just going to get it because it's the Hall of Fame. It wasn't anything that like, you know, sort of screamed at me, but it is a Kate Somerville product, um, which is a really, really well known brand. And it says Hollywood's two minute facial. So it's the Kate Somerville Ex Exfoliate, intensive exfoliating treatment um, that it is a 15 mil. Uh, and it says AM or PM, use this uh, once or twice a week, apply a thin even layer to clean a wet face, massaging in circular motions for 30 seconds, leave on for two minutes, rinse and pat dry. It says the product may cause the skin to tingle or flush uh, slightly for a short time for sensitive skin, leave on, leave on for less time um, or less than one minute, 
and it says uh, use exfoliate gentle instead so there's obviously another option um, it's a sample I'm assuming it's a sample um, but I'll pop the price up there but that's what it looks like that and I think we are down to the last one what did I choose okay the last thing I chose was a green vitamin concentrate serum uh, this is a con uh, concentrate facial serum to combat uh, oxidative damage and accelerate cell repair so I've got a bit of a thing for skincare I'm getting old now I'm like 41 too soon it's scary next year um, so anything that I can do to help my skin I will give a try I'm always changing up my skincare I think currently I'm using an Elemis moisturizer but at night time I use the shush cos is it shush cosmetics you guys will have seen a previous review I'll put it up there if, if if I remember um, it's like a, um, a natural uh, serum anti-aging serum it's really really nice and I use it at night time I wouldn't use it in the day it, it, I, I don't know I don't like oily skin in the day but it smells amazing and I really really do enjoy it so I use that at night um, so I do mix things up quite a lot with my skincare which has sometimes resulted in like adverse effects with certain products I can't remember the one that I had a massive allergic reaction to because that was the worst my face just like went huge I was all puffy my eyes closed up so obviously it you know by doing what I do I am taking a risk with products but um, yeah generally I'm okay with most products but there has been a couple what's the other one glam glow I can't use certain glam glow products they make my skin go all weird and like bumpy and textured so I don't I don't tend, tend to reach for glam glow ever because my skin just doesn't seem to like certain products um yeah this is the green vitamin concentrate obviously the price will be have been up there it's 99.9% .9 natural so I think that's probably why I chose it because it sounds really really good sorry about my nails guys I've probably said this in a previous video um, but I'm the kind of person that when I'll do my nails and they look great and then I'll do the washing up without putting gloves on and I'll clean the house and then they all tend to chip and peel even if it's gel gel is not indestructible it does tend to peel and chip if you mess with chemicals or if you're cleaning if you've got your hands in water a lot which I do so they look terrible but they look really they did look really cute <laughs> they look really cute um but yes so yeah that is that product and yeah i can't wait to use that i think that is us are we are we good are we done there is some leaflets it says welcome to freshly cosmetics which is this one this is freshly cosmetics and um, the natural way of making an impact on your skin and the planet um and then there is a floral street is there another perfume in here? No, it just has like a... Is that scented? Oh, I think it is. Um, this is the Sunflower Pop. I do like Floral Street. Some of them are really, really nice. Um, but this one's the Citrus Fruity Fragrance Sunflower Pop. Bringing joy and sun soak bursting with rays and of optimism. A masterpiece in a bottle. It's vegan and cruelty free. Sustainably sourced ingredients. Recycled packaging. Inspired by London oh, it's, it smells beautiful that I, I so the sample is that it smells lovely I definitely wear that oh I wish it was a little spray one though but it smells lovely so there's a little a little floral street I don't know if that is this a new one maybe yeah so there's a little floral street sample in there it smells good so everything for latest and beauty will be linked down below so you guys can go and check them out yourselves if there's a referral code from myself it will be also down there with all my other referral codes um, so you should totally go and check it out but yes love this box love getting it every month let me know your thoughts guys what did you get this month well I say this month this is October's um, box but you may be seeing it in November but let me know if you guys what you got in October um, I'd love to know your thoughts what do you think have you tried any of the products let me know your thoughts I'm gonna let you guys go I hope you have a great day night morning evening whatever you're doing when you're watching this and I'll see you in the next one Bye.